San Angelo does have a rose garden, but next to that, you'll find a large pool filled with lilies. Really a beautiful sight, and it has gained really international attention. So much so that we sent our Phoenix O'Connor to speak with the creator who still maintains it to this day. Uh, I just happened to collect lilies like some people collect antiques. Ken Landon's love for lilies has helped beautify the city of San Angelo. And it all started with an empty pool that needed to be filled. A pool down here in Civic Lee Park that we did not know what to do with. Would you mind uh, seeing if you can do something there? And I said, well, okay, we can put some lilies in there. And, and he did. Within three years, I had international notoriety here down here at Civic Lee Park. West Texas, we're not, you don't really think of us having any kind of aquatics here. But they are here from the Amazon to the Nile River. Lilies from all around the world. It's not easy. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of effort. And because of Landon's effort, the state of Texas has an official water lily. The Nymphia Texas Dawn, which was created by Landon and was designated as Texas official water lily on April 26, 2011. To see things that not only you wouldn't see uh, even in a collection where they have this kind of thing, uh, because the collection that I have is second to none. There's nothing like it. I mean, I've got the largest collection in the world. As for his personal favorite? Oh, they're kind of like kids you know, they don't have a favorite. What inspires him every day is the message to spread joy, love, and happiness into the world. As long as you're trying to make the world a better place for those people and anybody else who comes down here, that's the reason we're here in the world anyway. So anytime you need a break, Lynn invites you to come down relax and see the true beauty that only nature can offer. In San Angelo, Phoenix O'Connor, Fox West, Texas. So that's quite the sight. Where is that? That's beautiful. Yeah, it's, 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 it's unique. It really sets San Angelo apart for a lot of ways. Uh, the great news is that if you want to check out the lilies with your own eyes, and many of you already have, maybe you'll see it differently now with knowing this story. Uh, they actually have an event this Saturday from 9 to 2. It will be held at Civic Link Park in San Angelo, where the International Lily Collection is located. You can check it out there. More information always available at myfoxzone.com. Where is that from here? Do you know off the top of your head? Yeah, it's not too far. Okay. We have a lot of the, the, the promo videos that you guys see, the photos, the, the water lilies water are in there. You know when you, you read somebody's literature on something, they say, you know, worldwide or world mm -hmm. renowned, or, you know, they, they're on their site, it says worldwide acclaimed, and you think, okay. But I actually did the research, like we do, we look things up before we come on air, and it's a huge deal. I actually was looking and reading on it, and I mean, think about, these are flowers from all over the world. It, it's cool because a lot of folks out there, of course, are familiar with it, but now you can go out there and have maybe a deeper appreciation for it being in San Angelo because you now know a little bit more about it, maybe more than we thought you did to begin with. One more time here, you find those little nuggets, right? Absolutely. Plenty more of the rundown still ahead.